Last year, I had my first trip to Lagos and I went by road and told you guys about the road trip in the last video, which is linked in the description box of this video. But in today's video, we will be talking about some of the things that happened the days following my arrival into Lagos. So stay tuned. Hey guys, good afternoon. So today is my second day in the city yesterday i didn't do anything i basically stayed indoors most of the day like throughout yesterday not even most of the day only stepped outside the building in the, in, the, in the night so today i'm supposed to head out to victoria island because i have one or two things that i need to do over there and from checking the boat from here to that side estimated time of arrival is like 30 minutes to one hour give a range and then estimated price I'm seeing 7,000 there <laughs> you all know my coins will not be spent like that once I saw that I was like Vivian brace yourself you are jumping the bus and you are not going to get missing so I've asked around for directions as to how to get there and Google map is my friend we are not going to get missing. I'm going to take you guys along. So you guys, let's get going. You guys, this place I'm staying eh? it takes time far from express. Let me not lie. So I would need to make a couple of stops before getting to the express bus stop. And the first one I need to do is I need to get a bike that will get me to one junction like that. I'll be able to either get a bus or keke that will get me to the express. And when I get to the express, then I will now be able to get a bus that will take me to Victoria Island. Hmm, sounds like a lot, but let me know I spend money now. Shebi, let's move. I, however, got to the express, but then I chose to wait a little bit at the bus stop because I wanted to understand the environment a little bit before proceeding to get onto any bus. After waiting for a few minutes, I eventually got onto one bus and then... <laughs> Guys, I honestly wasn't ready for what followed immediately I entered into the bus. So let me put things into context for you guys. Lagos buses are built differently. First off, their seats are made purely of metal and wood. No form of covering whatsoever. What's upholstery? What's that? That's a foreign term to them. I got into the bus and you will not believe it that there were metals poking from almost everywhere and one of them tore my blouse. I tried to expose my bride price, people of Zion, bride price that is even remaining small. Hey! Anyway, I was carrying my backpack thankfully so I just turned it around and wore it from front to back to you know you know preserve what's left of this bright prize because my father ain't gonna get just a handshake on my wedding day. Dear people of Zion, your girl was able to effectively utilize Google Maps in Lagos City for the first time. Mm -mm. Small dance, small dance, small dance. Anyways, let's get serious. I eventually got to my destination bus stop without getting lost. Can somebody praise the name of Jesus for me? Eh? Anywho, I only need to locate the estate I'm going to. <laughs> anyway, I was able to locate where I was going to without any issues and without getting lost any further. <laughs> But because I had so many things I needed to attend to, I got straight into business when I got there and then the next morning, I headed to Ikoyi for my appointment from Victoria Island. And after I was done with my appointment, one of my longtime friends came to pick me up and then we went to get lunch. You guys know I like me my food. And then I headed straight back to Victoria Island picked up my things and went back to the other side of the back of lagos where i'm coming from this video is already getting too long and i haven't shown you guys the things that amaze me with this um city of lagos or rather this country because it deserves to be a country of its own but don't you worry guys i'm going to be posting the part three of this video and also i promise you guys you won't have to wait for another two weeks because <laughs>
The video has been edited already, so I'll be posting it on Wednesday. Or rather, I think you guys should let me know in the comment section when you would want me to post it. So, thanks for watching. Bye.